Our first public look at Black Ops 6 is now here, guys, with COD Next, and the event was great. We saw a lot of things. We're going to break down a lot of those in today's video. First and foremost, though, we got to touch on one of the bigger creators actually kind of making a surprise return to COD Next, despite what went on last year or over those, you know, those rocky months with Call of Duty. It's Tim the Tatman, arguably the biggest name involved in COD Next this year, and he was involved in a lot of ways as he uh, learned very early on this might not be the game for him as very early on. Uh, about an hour and a half into gameplay, Tim the Tatman says, mouse and keyboard for Call of Duty, it might just be cooked. Dude, someone on my team is using a pila. I'm just gonna ignore I can't hit a job. Dude, I, I'm not trolling chat. I'm not kidding you. Obviously, I'm not at my setup. But I think I have to play controller on this game. For all the movement and like shit, like that, it, mouse and key is tough, dude. Mouse and key may be cooked. How is she alive, bro? I don't understand. Like this, that, that right there, okay? For me to do that, I have to switch my finger. Well, hit shift, I have to hit shift, dive. it's HPT tough, it is not easy on mouse and key. Enemy HPT on site, take them out. Oh. Dude, the Pass best I did was literally with the M4 on there. I'm just getting back to my rock. Oh. Our HPT has been eliminated. Like, my fingers are sore. Trying to do all the... I to do all the movement. Yeah, My fingers are so Go dark. We'll pick you up later. There's movement assists. I mean, I may need that. Where's that at, Wes? And shortly after that, we saw greatness from Tim because he was one of the first creators to implement the uh, the disconnect the disconnect line at the event as he DC'd from the game to maybe try and find some lobbies where Call of Duty and Warzone pros weren't absolutely riddling everybody. <laughs> Am I already defeated? Dude, does he have a chopper gun? Legion doesn't even know that I just left that lobby. But I just queued in. It's Adrian, Biffle, Celium. Yeah, okay. Let's just let's try again. Let's try again. Right game? Let's just, let's try again. Okay, this one seems a little more manageable for me. I just queued, did you see that that next lobby I just queued into? Did you guys see the names on that leaderboard? Celium. yeah, okay. Pro backed out. No, 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 no. No, I DC'd, you guys didn't see it? Legion, I disconnected, bro. And I can't fault him here. I would be doing the same exact thing if you see a lobby like that stacked with Warzone pros and COD pros. Just seeing Biffle and Selium alone, he was like, yep, let's just try again. And so he used that tactic a, a few times of backing out of lobbies. And again, I... I would be doing the same. I can't really fault him as Tim continued to struggle in multiplayer. And you got to remember who he's going up against. It's, it's some of the best. So it does make sense. And it feels like I had a place to resonate when I was watching Tim play Black Ops 6 because his anger, his frustration, and him sucking is, is like how I feel I would be if I am going to play this game. What's kill order? Keep Hunt enemies? Hunt enemies? Hunt enemies? Oh, this is like protect the president? This is kind of interesting. Positive ID, enemy. Did that person have shield? Did I just see that right? You fallen behind. They got our HPT. Enemy HPT is down. I ran out of mouse pad. I literally ran out of mouse pad. You know what, dude? I'm a simple man. I'm a simple man with a simple plan. Enemy HPT 
on site. Take them out. This shotgun. Hang on. I feel like that's got to be faster, no? Backup's not coming. You want to get out of this alive? Better step up. Our HPT's been eliminated. Oh, this is such a scale. Enemy UAV Why do we have three? Like, why am I am playing I? against two? All right. Am I cooked? Oh the HPT. I might be cooked, bro. Chad, I'm a Warzone player. Keep that in mind. All right. You know what? I'm just going to do what I have to do. I'm going to... Did that guy get knocked? What? I got to do what I got to do. This is how... Dude, I know how you play multiplayer. Do you have to... Do Dude, what is this game? <laughs> what is happening? Oh my god, I almost blew. Oh my god, I almost blew. That guy's one inch. I almost got a new first game. Did you really? You know what's crazy? You and me got the same amount of nukes in this game right now. Keep thinking about it. Oh, this, this is how I gotta play, dude. Oh, I like to protect our HPT. I don't know what that thing is. HPT under fire. Repeat. HPT under HPT's been eliminated. This rock was nice. We took out their HPT. Friendly HPT on site. Oh, I gotta play, man. I didn't even see that dude, bro. Press those to go. Press those to go. Wow. But that wasn't all we saw, as we also saw the Warzone side of things, including some Warzone creators. Joe Woe put up, I would argue, a great showing. I, I know we're going to get comments for saying that, but some of the clips that Joe Woe was putting down were absolutely nuts, as he was doing a great showcase alongside someone like Shotzi of Omni Movement, which will also be a big discussion going forward. Will it make or break Call of Duty? There have been tons of complaints online and tons of compliments online around this new Omni Movement. And, and I don't know, man. I, as a mouse and keyboard player, I I don't know if I can keep up with this. I know you guys are going to say, get better, and so I shall try, but here's that. Oh my gosh, bro. Clip that. And then, like, you can run, like, right or left. Like this, you see? I'm gonna take gun that guy real quick. Uh, like, you can run backwards, forwards. You can slide backwards, slide left, slide right, dive. It's gonna be turd. It's, cause right now, like I said, like, all my settings on stuff, I don't know how they are at the moment, you know, it's a little rough, but it's gonna be very- Yo, I've actually yeah, seen, actually, wait, out. is that the grandma who get those sniping clips? I don't know, but she came up to me last oh, context and was like, that's, she was whoa, like whoa, 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 what the fuck was that? Who was that? Who was that? What the fuck was that? And then even at one point, it was Joe O's team, Joe O's trio versus the boys over at Optic, that being Methods, Kenny, and Shotzi, just going head to head, pretty much back to back games in Warzone. They were going back and forth. Joe Woe nearly with a 1v3, but Shotzi got the best of him. I knew that was Ann, bro. That's comedy. Ooh. <laughs> that looked comedy. Uh, I'm dead, dead. Uh, Teep, uh, in what is us back? Yeah. Huge. Huge. Uh, you might have to rest somewhere else. They're all three. Okay. 
It is crazy, uh, but there's just literally one team up, like, bro, what? Um, that is wicked word. Ah, uh, no, dude, that lobby got cooked, bro. Yeah, there was something weird, but like, I think a lot of people just ended up lagging out. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, you did too, right? Thank you very much. I was in a 1v3, bro, what am I supposed to do there, man? And these are really two of the guys I was focusing on throughout Black Ops 6, especially someone like Shotzi coming from the Call of Duty Pro side, and he is going to be uh, the real, the, 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 the testing instrument of how this Omni movement is going to perform, I would say, in the CDL. So when you listen to him say maybe there's a little less aim assist this time around, he also gives compliment to this being potentially the best Call of Duty since the inaugural season of the CDL, which is exciting. And on the flip side, you look towards someone like Joe or other Warzone pros there like Biffle to be like, okay, how is this going to play out for them in the omnidirectional department of competitive Warzone? It's going to change a lot across the board. And I just want to say this does not contribute to the Warzone versus Call of Duty Pro debate, okay? Methods was tweeting out there. Apparently, you weren't supposed to be stacking and queuing together, but people were regardless. And I know the COD bros, they were doing their thing, but it was... It wasn't set grounds, okay? They were they were maybe breaking rules, and I know there were some complaints out there. So this does not contribute to the CDL versus Warzone debate, but that is it. We got Tim the Tatman rage quitting in a great way uh, out of lobbies to get easier games for himself at COD Next. And we also have Omni Movement. What do you guys think about it? Is it going to make Call of Duty? Is it going to break Call of Duty? Are you with it or against it? And until next time, we hope you guys all enjoy. What was your favorite part about the event? What are you looking forward to? And maybe what are you scared about for Black Ops 6 coming soon? Till next time, take care of yourselves. We will be giving away copies of this game uh, closer to release in our Discord down below, as well as on our Twitters. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you back here tomorrow.